Thank you for tuning in for this investment update. Uh, in the email, you'll find some information around your portfolio and investment markets in general and some commentary from our team. But we certainly find ourselves in a very different environment that we did in, at 30 June or even 30 September, which is the date of the document that you have there. Um, we've seen data that come out in relation to uh, rates of inflation and interest rates, which is having an impact on portfolios. So is the global conflict specifically the conflicts in the Middle East, because as viewers of this uh, series or clients of ours will understand that markets do not appreciate or they do not like uncertainty, and they have a habit of uh, overcorrecting or overshooting, whether it's uh, good news or bad. And that's where the role of the investment committee comes in. It's our role to support you and ensure that you can look past some of these troubling and uh, challenging events which can be emotional and impactful and our role is to ensure that the portfolios are positioned well. Now uh, the data that you see on the screens at the moment you'll see that the portfolios have recently been rebalanced and the effect of that is that we have gone out and acquired more interests in international equities and sold down some of your secure assets and the purpose of that rebalancing is to ensure that where possible we take profits along the way and we top up strategies which over the long term will add value to your portfolio but we take advantage of depressed prices. Now other actions of the investment committee over the last two years have certainly supported your portfolio over the last quarter with the four pillars policy providing a little more downside protection and we can see that from the managers that we've selected in your portfolio. Now at all times, I strongly encourage you to speak with your advisor if you have any concerns around your portfolio and to make sure that you have sufficient cash on hand to trade through any challenging periods. For those of you that are long-term investors, and I'm hoping that you are, you can see on the graph on the screen here that there have been drops over the last three to five years. And at the time, they always feel particularly large. But when you're in the, looking in the rear view mirror and markets have moved forward, some of those impactful falls don't seem as impactful. That's where the quarterly rebalancing comes in and the importance of having a long-term point of view. So once again, I strongly encourage you to speak with your advisor if you have any concerns and to make sure that you're positioned well for the future. Thank you.